All right, so it's Saturday morning. I'm in Western North Carolina and uh, I'm trying to catch some trout. I've been trout fish for like two years, mostly been doing warm water stuff on the fly. I've been trying to get out here, but I just haven't in a long time, uh, mostly because my car's unreliable and I kept being afraid of breaking down. But yeah, I was hoping to fish last night, uh, but I didn't because I got to the campground late and it was full. Um, and so then I took, spent kind of like the rest of daylight finding another place to camp and setting up and all that. Camping went all right, despite not being in the spot I expected to be. <laughs> I'm actually like five minutes from uh, one of the places that I was planning on fishing. Uh, mostly gonna be fishing wild trout waters. There's a few catch and release streams that I've marked out too, and one hatchery supported spot that I might get to. Um, but yeah, it's October. Uh, the leaves are starting to change. It's real pretty out. Uh, yeah, let's let's get after it. Ding. Oh, got one, baby. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, uh, I don't know what that is. Just some kind of little shiner guy. Another little tiny one. <laughs> Yes. 
First day went well, in my opinion. Um, I caught a few fish in the morning, a couple little tiny minners, and then two browns, wild trout water, so I assume they're wild, um, which is cool. And, uh, you know, I was not fishing as smooth as I'd like, but again, I'm trying to cut myself some slack because I haven't fished or trout in a while, and I've just been doing warm water stuff. And I feel like I adjusted, you know, quick enough. Um, not all the way there yet, but uh, had a good time. Finished fishing, booked it over to the campground, managed to get a spot, uh, which were in short supply even when I got here. So I have a real campsite this time, which is nice because that meant I was able to fish a little later. And then I fished another spot. Um, didn't go as well at the other spot. Um, last time I fished that two years ago, it was like kind of hidden, but you know, people knew about it. But now there's a whole greenway trail there. So I imagine that spot's pretty pressured. Um, I also was fishing it pretty quick um, because that parking lot, I guess they like tow at dusk. Um, so I was trying to cover some water and get back. But anyway, we're going to make some dinner and um, hit the sack. And then we're going to go fish again in the morning. Sunday morning, and uh, I'm at a wild stream, kind of skinnier water, and uh, hoping to catch some fish. I think I will. I know I will catch some fish. It's a little chilly out. Didn't have any luck yesterday at the spot I went to in the afternoon. I'm gonna try to take my time with this creek because I rushed myself last night, but at the same time, I kind of want to see if I can't leave some time for a wider stretch of the river to try to catch maybe some bigger fish. I don't know. I just like, I just like want to catch a big fish, uh, which usually I, I don't mind if I catch small fish as so long as I'm catching them, but I don't know. Um, maybe it's because I've just been catching bass uh, that I'm feeling that, but... I don't know. We'll see. So we're on the way back, uh, didn't end up 
get any more fish today. But that's just the way of the road, you know. Uh, the way she goes, some, sometimes she goes, sometimes she doesn't. And uh, it wasn't today, but it, it made yesterday morning, so it's all good. I chalk some of that up to just like my skills. Uh, like I said, um, haven't been trout fishing in a while, and so I'm still kind of getting the hang of it. Uh, but also, I think that cold front changed a lot more than I thought it would. I talked with a guy at the fly shop, and um, he had said that, you know, they were biting pretty good throughout the week. But then obviously Friday, that rain come in, and the temps dropped like, you know, 20 degrees on average. Um, and so, you know, I, I'd like to think that did something to them to make me not catch as much. But regardless, I still had a lot of fun. We made it this far. Thanks for hanging around. Um, if you like the video, you know, like it, subscribe, maybe like leave a comment or something. Um, and if you didn't like the video, leave a comment saying you hate me. Whatever. Um, yeah. Till next time. See y'all soon sometime. See ya.